Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I will show you how we can create a scroll react in Unity and make a scroll auto move on button click. First I will show you how it look like. Now you see that I have made a simple button and when I click on button a panel is show and panel start moves automatically. Now, this is the scene. Now I will show you how to create this type effect in Unity. I have created a simple screen name, uh, name it scroll rect scene and now simple right click and go to UI and create a panel. Now go to canvas scale uh, canvas and set it to screen space to camera and after that give the camera in render camera section and then go to canvas scale and convert it to scale with screen size now we should have to set our panel and give a background i have created a scroll background name for it you can use any of it now let's reset it again oh set native size now that's why to that uh, increase its alpha so we can see our background panel move a panel and increase its size as well we can see it you can change according to your need and give a name to panel now again right click on it and go to UI and create an other panel now go to the panel and change its alpha to one so we can hide the white background from this panel and after that uh, add a component with second panel click on add component and find scroll react because we want to move our scroll vertically so uncheck the horizontal and after that click on panel again and create an empty object and go to panel again and drag and drop this panel to scroll rect content section after that go to game panel and add a component group layout sorry for that uh, vertical layout group and click on child alignment and click on middle center now double click on our game object and let's set it now click on game object and create a simple UI button Now decrease the button size according to our panel. Now let's increase its size and see if it works or not. Now you see that our panel is moved. Now go to the button and give the image sprite that you want. I have 
these sprites simply drag and drop it set to native size and simply duplicate it and let's increase our game object length drag and drop the uh, images that you want to implement in your panel you can implement any type of image as you want now let's play again and see how it works now let's increase the go to the panel and decrease its length inside of our background image so it can look perfect this way and after that uh, go to the uh, game object and let's increase its size and also you can give the space to our buttons now go to the game object and go to uh, vertical layout group section and increase its spacing now we should have i think it's let's play again and see how you see that panel is moved fine now again go to the panel section and add a component name it mask so we can hide our object when they leave outside of this panel now you see that the key object that are outside of this panel is hide with this mask now it look perfect that's good now let's go to the second step create a simple ui buttons so we can move our scroll when we click on the buttons i have created a simple button and name it to Panel. and increase its size so we can see it perfectly and also increase the x size make it bold okay now you see that we have created a panel and also create a button now click on button and add a event on it i have created a simple game object and add a component a simple script auto scroll uh first i will show you what is the inside of this script now i have used simple using unity engine dot ui because we want to access our ui element from script and in create a simple game object name it food panel so we can hide it when we click on it and after that i have create a auto scroll function using a nominator and this is the fruit button function in fruit button function simply i have create fruit panel dot set active true when we click on our fruit panel it will active and i have also call a core team name it auto scroll and pass the parameter to it game object dot find panel dot get component scroll when i have get the panel of our objects and get the component of scroll rect and give the 
some parameter start time and end time and also the position now let's go to the auto scroll function i have create a coroutine denominator auto scroll scroll react and get the create a object scroll react and give the float start position float end position and float duration these three parameters are used to move our panel automatically according to the time and duration and in this function yield return uh, wait for second 0.5 and then i have checked the print l so we can see our function is working or not and after that simply click float t0 equal to 0.0 i have create a float variable and give it name t0 and give set its value to 0.0 and simply create a loop while t0 less than 1.0f then we have increase our t0 time t0 plus is equal to time dot delta time and divided it with duration duration is the time that we are give to our scroll and after that scroll react dot horizontal normalize position is equal to i have get this scroll react dot normalized horizontal normalized position is equal to math app dot layer function of unity and give the parameter of start position end position and the time t0 you can implement it in any type of scroll like horizontal or vertical i have write two functions for it scroll react dot uh, vertical normalized position is equal to math app dot lab lab function and give the start position end position and time t0 and after that simply your return null. now this is the function that i have used because we are uh, i am using vertical normalized position so this function this line of function is accessed and if you use horizontal you can write a simple this line or you can write both lines it's no problem with it now simply save it and after that go to the button section of our panel now first set go to the game object and give the fruit panel to drag and drop this fruit panel inside of auto scroll script and after that uh, now disable this fun uh, fruit red panel and go to the button function and drag and drop this game object so we can access the script inside and access the function of fruit panel now save it let's play and see if it works or not now you see that when i click on button the scroll will show and auto moves you can increase the time and position of scroll rank again i have clicked now you see that the scroll moves automatically this is the way you can move your scroll if you have any question you can leave a comment if you like this video subscribe to my channel and share this video